Hey everyone, welcome back. Today we're going to look at comparing radicals. If you've completed the previous video, mixed and entire radicals, then today's lesson will be a lot easier for you. So we're going to look at this question, which is greater, 3 root 5 or 2 root 7? And so what we're going to do is rewrite the mixed radical as an entire radical because it'll be easier to compare. So here we have square root 5, so we're going to go square square root on the 3 like that. This gives root 9 root 5, which gives root 9 times 5, which gives root 45. Here we have 2 root 7, so square root here, so we're going to go 2 squared square root as such. Root 4 root 7, root 4 times 7 gives root 28. And now since root 45 is bigger than root 28, then 3 root 5 is greater than 2 root 7. Okay, so straight away for some practice for you. Practice number one, order the numbers from least to greatest. Go ahead and pause the video and answer that. Okay, we're back. So we're going to write all of the numbers in entire radicals. So 3 root 8, so we got square root, so we're going to go square square root like that, which gives root 72. 5 root 2, so 5 squared square root like that, which gives root 50. 7, we're going to go square square root to give root 49. And root 48 is already there. So we have root 48, root 49, root 50, and root 72. So in other words, we have root 48, 7, 5 root 2, and 3 root 8 like that. This is from least to greatest as such. Okay, B. 2 root 17, so square square root like that. This gives us root 68. 13 square square root gives root 169. One, root 167 stays. 8 root 3, so square square root like that. We get root 192. So we're going from least to greatest. So root 68 root 167, root 169, and root 192. And so the order is 2 root 17, root 167, 13, and then 8 root 3. And that's it. Is that easy? I'll see you guys in the next video.